Om Shanti and welcome to your own channel. Here today we are going to do a recording of both yesterday's 9th of June and today's 10th of May. Let's go ahead with 9th of June's blessing where God wants us to believe and experience everything on the basis of nothing new so that we become more comfortable in our own skin. We become more and more understanding and more patient. So let's see what Supreme Godfather has to say here. Baba says, may you be an embodiment of experience and overcome all obstacles by considering them to be a game with the awareness of nothing new. So life is a game, but do we treat it like a game or not? Depends upon whether we know the knowledge of nothing new. God says, it is fixed in the drama from the beginning to the end for obstacles to come. But those obstacles make you experienced in making the impossible possible. So either we are either experience holders or we are success holders. More experience, more the success is possible. For experienced souls, obstacles are a game. For example, in football, a ball comes to you, you kick it and you enjoy playing that game. But let's say if nobody is there in front of you, nobody is there to defend, no forward player is there, no defender is there. How do you feel? You feel like it's such an easy game. You just go and run and straight away shoot. There's no pleasure in that. But when you have people in front of you, the defenders, and you're dribbling and you're moving and you're going past them and then you goal, that's the fun part, isn't it? Similarly, in life also, many people come as obstacles in front of us. Instead of getting angry with them, frustrated with them, blaming them, complaining about them, just one thing, nothing new. This drama is full of people who come as obstacles, but they come as stepping stones in a life. So they are nothing new. This mantra is something which helps us. So God says, this game of obstacles continues in the same way. It is nothing new. The drama shows us these games and also show us total success. So if we make those people who come as obstacles in our life as friends instead of foes, we earn blessings from them instead of getting against them or going against them, going against their thoughts, their wishes. We can either befriend them and move ahead and make them as stepping stones or we can have them as further big boulders in our life, stopping us from moving ahead. So everything and every person teaches us something. What do we learn in every obstacle is dependent on our attitude of how we take it as. Keeping the virtues, keeping the values in our hands and the powers which we learn in spirituality in Brahma Kumaris in our hands, we can easily face those obstacles. We can earn blessings and those blessings will make us float higher towards our success. How do we do that? What is this process? Is what we learn at Brahma Kumaris. You too can come and learn that. Om Shanti.